seven grams. So talking the dark. As the matriarch rise, you know, your intellect should rise with it. And it's supposed to be a matriarch, matriarchal um, ran society. Get that right. But as I just vibe through the, through the night and I get ready for the takeover, the takeover is the flip. Everything, you need to start flipping everything around. Man is not first. Um, niggas sold, niggas. You, you got to start. Do your own research. But do you, I mean, just get familiar. Because like, um, we are the Indians. Everybody ain't African. Uh, we all come from one place. and But we all different branches of the same tree. So... A lot of people don't never seen a reservation. And I ain't seen one until like a month ago. And I just find it fascinating that even though that's the they're one sixteenth of a of us, cause you for you to have that title you gotta come from us. And um just mean it melanated. You see that the reservations is another ghetto. Like they, we, the ghetto come from um, Jews, uh, and that's us too. But who was this all lied to? I want to show you um, a reservation and how they fucking over our people. But you know, it's just a lot of misdirections. You got to take race away and just look at the hand, the hitting hand, you know. When you drive around here, you'll see everything you expect to see. Dilapidated trailers, rundown storefronts, old cars. There's beggars and thieves and lots and lots of drunks. There's stray dogs roaming around all over the place. There's hardly even a tree around. It's like a desert prairie land of the lost. Most people here live in poverty. Perhaps one in four lives somewhat of a normal life. The reservation lies entirely within Todd County, which is the second poorest county in the nation. Eight of the nation's ten poorest counties all happen to be Native American reservations. The other two are border counties in Texas. There were ten million indigenous people here before European settlers came. Their numbers went down quite a lot after Europeans came because of war and disease. The ones that are left have faced centuries of persecution and discrimination. Almost all of them were forced onto reservations that lacked the resources needed to thrive. This particular reservation was established in 1889. Originally, the Lakota Sioux were given the whole western side of the state, but that land has been considerably reduced. You could call it stolen. Magic eraser. It's a game changer. You know, I could go and play more and um and go deep into it, but as you can see there's no buildings. There's no buildings nowhere in sight. There's nothing they has they had a few buildings. Cause I didn't want to play too much of the clip. But they had a few buildings, but it wasn't it was you need to see the casino, and they gave them they gave us money. Cause see, I got the, the line gotta go. It's a it's a it's a line. As long as you keep saying them them them, is we all gotta be one. That's all if you want to be family. And everybody who look like you ain't you. So the race thing gotta go. But they fucked over, and it's it's your own people that does this. So we got to realize that the enemy is within. I ain't telling you go get a, put a gun on every, at your next family member, but I mean, hey, you, you, if he, if he ain't been acting right, if, they, if, if he got a bad or she got a bad track record, I mean, you know, you got to do what you got to do. I mean, I know there's not a physical war, there's a spiritual war, so you might want to relieve yourself from the, from the um, place and get your own space if you can, because... Everybody that look like you is not 
family. And that's a hard pill to swallow, but you must attack that. Because the same people that agreed to put us in bondage looked like you. It's the history of it, you know what I mean? And, and it's all misdirection while you fight with race. The enemy look like you in your fucking place. Real lies, real lies, real eyes, real, real eyes, real lies, real lies. I think I fucked it up still, but close enough. Seven grams. Still we rise. Shout out to the real ones doing real work. And I think it's fucked up. Um, how they doing? You know how we just keep going for the debate. This money shit, this important, this job title shit, this, we gotta, I mean, I ain't saying don't protect yourself, but we got that shit like it's God. Ask yourself, is money your God? Or is it a tool? Seven gram soul talk in the dark. Still we rise. What up, Kisello? What up, Z3 with the Kona 3? Let the matriarch rise. Shout out to Wisdom Night 2. All the realm was lying in this den. Peace. Without trap.